So now I'm going to show you how to answer a call and to handle call waiting on a phone using your Cisco 7940 or 7960 IP phone. When you have a call coming in, simply lift the receiver or you may press your speakerphone button to take the call. You'll notice on your display you have the caller ID, the length of the call, as well as the status of the call which shows it's an active call. Now, while I'm speaking to that line 1, I'm going to dial in on another line and show you call waiting. You will notice that you will see both visually on the phone that there is now a second call coming in as well as in the receiver you're going to hear the do let you know there's a call waiting. So to answer your second call simply press the answer button on your phone. Alright you'll notice that the first call now shows it is paused and your second call now shows your length and shows it is an active call. Now you have a green button in the middle, that's your toggle button. What you can do with it is you can scroll back and forth and highlight which call that you want to do an action for. For instance, if you want to pick back up your line one, simply highlight it and press resume. Now you'll notice that the second that your original call is active and your second call shows paused. And you can use your toggle button again and you can resume your call back to line two if you want and put your line one back on hold. You may do that indefinitely, actually, but you'll notice that when you resume calls, it never terminates your either call. You have to do that action yourself, and that's keep you from inadvertently hanging up on someone. So, I'm going to hang up on my original call. I'm going to press end call. Now, my second call shows it's still active. It's on pause at the moment. It's on hold. They're hearing hold music, rest assured. Simply press my resume button, and now I have my call active again. And to end the call, simply hang up, and that's all there is to it.